Well, I couldn't stay away from my home. How could I? I spent so much time here. But I'm glad to have the other place where I'm staying now. It's really a blessing to uh, have a little bit more complete shelter with all of this crazy weather we're having, all of this wild rains and winds and high seas. And the sea is super high again. Of course, it's the new moon. That's to be expected. As you can see. It's quite difficult to get here from that way. But I like to be here. It's really nice. And it's so warm, I'm barely wearing any clothes. In fact, I could be naked, but I don't want to offend anyone with my glorious nudity. And I, you know, I tidied up a bit here. It's still kind of a mess, but uh, inside I've got all the things. Maybe it's not visible, but I packed up all of the cushions and things like that, and extra blankets, sleeping bag, pillows. It's all in there, inside the bunker, secure. Uh, but I, I miss being here because I've got my fireplace, I've got all of my elements worked out to satisfy all of my needs that I've carefully tailored to my own self and I can't help but feeling like a guest in this other place you know because I am it's someone else's spot this is the spot that I made so it's my home and still is I'm I'm of a feeling that I'm on a kind of vacation and uh, <laughs> A vacation from here and maybe I will come back uh, to stay maybe not we'll see how the weather turns out the forecast is for some more rains the coming days and uh, with these high seas it's really difficult to stay here if I want to go and do things uh, in town. I'm not in a hurry to leave yet, the, at least to leave the area, because it's really great. It's been so great for me to have this alone time and to be very slow. And uh, for example, today I woke up, I had an interesting dream, I made some breakfast, favorite uh, cabbage salad with carrots and garlic and uh, I did some laundry so I washed some of my clothes and they're drying now in the sun and uh, things are feeling good I did some exercise I came here I talked to the ancestors a bit and uh, got a few more things to bring back over to the hut and that's my status for now <laughs> looks nice.
there is no rest but so far my bed isn't getting wet and neither is this other one that I'm not using so far the beds are dry and the rain is falling through the cracks of this slowly decaying roof panel. Yeah, you can see the wind is coming from the south. It's blowing the waves almost completely horizontal to the beach right now. You can't even see the islands. You can't even see the top of the highest mountain. First one in more than a week, I think. I hope there's more. Hello, donkey. How are you? Are you enjoying the sunshine today? Enjoying to eat some nice tasty herbs? Nah, you're stuck to the fence. Oh, I don't want to scare you much. Yeah. Hi. Cool. Another sunny day at the hut. I'm with my friend Leo. It's making a chapati pizza and it's warmer than it was. It's not easy living this life, but it's good. We've got our hobo can and it's working pretty well for cooking. It's cold in the night, maybe around 1 or 2 degrees Celsius if even. But in the day, it's maybe around 10. And the sun, it helps. I'm solar powered. And I need... I need to absorb because there's so much chaos in my life right now from the past uh, weeks of rain. That it's really hard to be motivated to do anything. Mm, that's okay. It's the end of the year. Solstice is coming and... Uh, it's normal for everyone to be a little bit sluggish and uh, going inside so we're doing okay 